Good evening, everybody. It is 6 p.m. on Wednesday, March 23rd, 2022. It's uh, time for gratitudes and prayerless prayers. 6 p.m. Alexa, cancel. I'm grateful for the health that I do have, even though I'm very tired still a lot with COVID-19 long hauler syndrome. Um, I'm grateful for to eat good food. Last night I had a chicken salad, um, a spinach and arugula salad with chicken in it that I had made from a roast chicken, and broccoli with ch steamed broccoli with cheddar, and a big bowl of grapes and strawberries. Probably gonna have the same thing tonight. Probably gonna do that. I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful to have electricity and money to pay it with. Um, I'm grateful for my blackboard, honestly. I don't use it as much as I would be if I were not sick, but uh, it does come in handy when I'm, you know, just kind of sketching out notes for myself. And, and uh, so I'm grateful that I've had that. I have that. I've wanted to have one, I wanted to get one for years. Um, I'm grateful to have cable TV. Another thing that I don't spend a ton of time in front of television, um, but when I want to watch it, it's there, you know, and, I, and when I want to put some news on or just watch an old show or something like that, it's there. And I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful for Windows. fresh air and I'm grateful to live in a place where we have a good fresh air here though we do have a lot you know of the wind down here is dusty and stuff like that so uh, that leads me to my next gratitude wind is generally dusty anyway you know what I mean but I, I noticed that you know if you leave windows open in South City definitely you get a lot of dust blown around um, but uh, my next gratitude is being able to clean because I've I'm, I'm been ill, but I'm able to keep up with my housework, and that, like, thank God for that, because it can pile up, you know what I mean, if you, if you don't watch out, and that's something that we take for granted when we feel well, um, and it doesn't take much to really kind of, like, let it fall by the wayside, so I'm grateful that I'm able to do that, and it is a little bit more difficult with having to do dishes in the bathroom, but uh, things so far so good. Um, I'm grateful to have been able to leave a message with my HSA caseworker today. I still have not heard from her. Um, 
So I'm grateful to have the energy to keep up on that case and to soon file that complaint. I'm not doing it yet. I'm allowing, I want to make sure I allow ample time to pass. Um, I'm also waiting on the Lord. I'm grateful to be sitting here in prayer right now. We pray for our leaders in government, our President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris and all members of the United States Congress. In California, we pray for our Governor Gavin Newsom and his family. And of course, for the President's family and Vice President's family and all the uh, family members of the members of Congress, of course. Um, in San Mateo County, we pray for all police, fire, and emergency personnel, as well as the Human Services Agency and the Department of Housing, and for all county workers not specifically named. In South San Francisco, we pray for our Mayor Mark and all members of the South San Francisco City Council. In San Francisco, we pray for Mayor London Breed and all members of the San Francisco Board of Supervisors. We pray for all those suffering through homelessness at the present time, for all victims of COVID-19 and COVID-19 long hauler syndrome, for abode services and life moves, both of which help homeless people find, get into, and stay in housing, and for clergy suffering with addiction and chemical depend dependency. We pray for all ministries inside and outside of the church, for all clergy and religious and lay leaders alike, especially our Holy Father, Pope Francis, Pope Benedict, Bishop Mark Hanley Andrus, Archbishop Salvatore Cordeleone, St. Gregory's Abbey, Three Rivers, Michigan, Hospitality House in San Bruno, C. Episcopal Church in South San Francisco and San Bruno, the Diocese of California, the Archdiocese of San Francisco, Reverend Patrick Driscoll, St. Veronica's Catholic Church in South San Francisco, the Reverend Deborah Hawkins, Bishop Louis Jeleno, St. Bruno's Catholic Church in San Bruno, and the Reverend David Grant Smith, the new vicar of the Episcopal Church. So pray for all members of my family, especially my father Alex and my mother Cheryl, as well as Kara Masick, Erwin Rossmeyer, Joshua, Jesse, Ben, and Max, my brothers, Mark, Jesse, and Diane Darling, Bob Ottaviano, Anna and Theta Crumby, Jocelyn Gerard, Donna Brown, and Diane Carlson.
well as praying for those members of my extended human family that I'm about to name here. Beginning with Junior Irwin, Stuart Packman, Eric Mosnes, Keegan Forbes, Michael Mould, Coulter and Rhiannon, Richard Simmons, Jim White, Andrew Marmelstein, Dave Maloney, Keith Watley, Jimmy Harder, Michael Zorns, Tony Vucetich, Aaron Rogers, Ruben Padilla, Travis Carpenter, Kurt Berry, Larry Burdett, Janine and Mike Jones, TJ Alstomsky, Drunk Phil, June, Ann and Sam, Lou and Gina, Peter Steeler, Daniel Hudson, Clifton Barrett, Rawl and Barbara Laborde, Mike Smith, Margie Burke and her family, Kyle Andrew Schofield, Laura and Lydia, Jason Hayes, Jack and Ramit and their family, Gino and his family, Charles Ratcliffe, Chris Reinhardt, Dustin Keast, Norma Liebke, Matthew Russian, Tyler Davis, Daniel Fonseca, Michael and Corey, Ryan, Dean Varchetto, Pat Ford, Tina, Keith, Alexander, Matthew Mustashkin, Kevin Johansson, the Republicano family, Tyler Jordan Lowe, Tyler Smith, Charles and Kim Plyler and their family, Anita, David, Michael and his mother, Al, Cheeseburger, Kenny, Kendrick, Dylan, Charlene Myers, Jeffrey Marmelstein, Steve Buiza, the Pacific Family Medicine Clinic staff, Beth Lewis, Ken McCune, Bob and Alice Katz, Jen and Jesse, Steve Menini, Larry Lawton, Gabby Giffords, Jeff Henkel, Mark Zuckerberg and his family, John, Bill O'Reilly, Christopher Henning, Scott Akers, Debbie, George Jetson, Lil Kim, Gustavo Caldas, John Shuck, Greg Flowers, Rick Rivero, Andy Han, Stephen and Bernadette Connolly, the people of Ukraine, Skeeter, and Russell. And last but not least, we pray for all those that have passed on from this life inside and outside the faith and fear of the Lord, especially the holy souls in purgatory and the church triumphant, as well as the repose of the souls of Howard Connolly, Christine Baker, the Reverend and Mrs. Fred and Cheryl Merrick, Nick Lee, Mickey McGee, Keith Lloyd, James, Dustin Rasmussen, John Judicki, Anita Rossmeyer, Phil D. Martino, Father Benedict Reed, Winfred and Marianne Johnson, Demetrius Fleming Davis, John Gotti, my grandparents on both sides, Jay Darling, Tyler White, Ron Popeil, Priscilla, Edison, Sean Bowman, Bob Dole, Betty White, Bob Saget, Harry Reed, Adolfo Caldas, Bill Brown, the Mariposa family, and Lori Ram. O Lord our God, accept the fervent prayers of your people, and the multitude of your mercies look with compassion upon us and all who turn to you for help. 
For you are gracious, O lover of souls, and to you we give glory, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen. Thank you for joining me this evening for prayerless prayers. Uh, I'm just going to remind you, as I do at the end of every video, and reminding myself to brush your teeth, to floss, especially and most especially to say your prayers. And I'll see you in the next video. I love you all, and peace.